ash handling system this lecture is part of the lecture series on steam power plant systems it may be useful for plant operating staff in a large steam generators using low grade coal with 33% to 5 to 45% ash content collection and disposal of ash poses a serious problem in a typical 500 megawatt coal fired unit production of ash per day varies from about 3.03 into 10 raised to power 6 kg to about 5.03 into 10 raised to power 6 kg depending on the quality of these low grade coals coal ash may be broadly classified into three parts the heaviest part clinker is collected at the furnace bottom at the bottom ash hopper the remainder is carried away by flue gas of which coarser ash in grit form is collected in economizer hoppers and air preheater hoppers finer ash in powdered form is further carried away by flue gas to either electrostatic precipitator and or bag filter where ash is separated from flue gas and collected in hoppers ash collected at the bottom of the furnace is called bottom ash and constitutes about 15% to 20% of total ash generated but at times could be as low as 10% the balance 80% to 85% of the total ash generated is called fly ash of which around 5% is coarse ash the function of the ash handling system is to remove ash collected at various hoppers as described in the previous slides and to dispose it conveniently to an allocated disposal area away from the main power house while collection and disposal of bottom ash and coarse ash is normally continuous that of fly ash is carried out periodically and sequentially wet bottom ash handling system the same diagram as in previous slide but little bigger in size for your reference request it is hope that this session is going to be useful to you please press like please subscribe यह लेक्चर हिंदी में भी उपलब्ध
वेट बॉटम एश हैंडलिंग सिस्टम इन अर्लियर डेज द एश हैंडलिंग सिस्टम यूज टू बी द वेट टाइप ड्राई बॉटम एश हैंडलिंग सिस्टम टूडे प्लांट्स यूज जीरो लीकेज सिस्टम्स टू कंप्लाई विद environmental protection regulations which usually means dry ash handling systems in a wet ash disposal systems the bottom ash is collected in water impounded hoppers located just below the boiler furnace and then is removed by jet pump eductors hydro ejectors coarse ash and fly ash in wet ash handling are collected either by wetting water jets or by a hydro pneumatic system all the slurry ash is then taken to an ash slurry sump from which this slurry is pumped into an ash pond for disposal dry bottom ash handling system the same diagram as in previous slide but little bigger in size for your reference in a dry ash handling system bottom ash and coarse ash are continuously disposed of through a metallic conveyor located beneath the boiler and typically transported to an intermediate bottom ash silo This metallic conveyor normally moves very slow. This is just opposed with flow of cold atmospheric air through the conveyor to the furnace due to furnace draft. This allows cooling of bottom ash prior to its disposal to the silo this charge from the bottom ash silo is sent pneumatically to the final bottom ash silo shown in figure for onward disposal through road tankers trucks etc the bottom ash hopper is provided with gates in the event that the metallic conveyor is under maintenance evacuation of the bottom ash is isolated with the help of these gates dry fly ash collected from the esp oblique bag filter hoppers is transported pneumatically to a remote silo via an intermediate surge hopper from the remote silo fly ash is 
disposed of through road tankers, trucks, etc. Whenever disposal through trucks, oblique tankers phase, an emergency dense phase slurry disposal system known as high concentration slurry disposal system acts as a backup. In this system, ash from the remote silos is discharged to a tank mixed with water to form dense slurry. Slurry from this tank is disposed of continuously to an ash disposal area through HCSD pumps. Request It is hoped that this session was useful to you. Please press like button. प्लीज सब्सक्राइब यह लेक्चर हिंदी में भी उपलब्ध है